The next two teams are coming into position. Heat two. This is uh, going to be Germany and the Philippines. This will be interesting because the Philippines um, uh, are a lighter group of paddlers. They um, have a very, very fast stroke rate and they will be using that to their advantage to really push their advantage maybe over Germany. But uh, Germany are extremely strong. Their stroke is totally different. Germans are in position already. Philippines aren't. They're, they're not in their race position, but the Germans are all down and ready. Are you ready, says the starter. Go! They're off. Let's see if the Philippines are going to get that early advantage or whether it's going to be the Germans. As they approach neck and neck with where I'm sitting, the Germans have a little lead over the Philippines, but the Philippines are powering past the Germans now. Whether that uh, continues to be the case in the next 20 metres, I don't know. Hi, Maury, you're back with me. Yes, indeed. I was watching down near the finish, uh, the last race. The uh, Germans haven't quite changed their style. I noticed the Canadians had uh, changed their style and they were very, very close. Another, another heat to go for both teams. And uh, Australia are now in position for the uh, heat three of the uh, 100 metres mixed team races. It's going to be Australia versus USA. So interestingly, the... Um, um, China are topping the points table at the moment. They're just doing the formal roll call. That's it. Uh, Australia are doing the best thing. They've got the paddles in the water alongside the boat. So now they're getting in position. Oh, hey, look. Oh, that, uh, that bang was a, a, a star flare, a green one. So the people down the road know we've started. USA now have taken Australia, but are they going to take it back? They haven't got much time to do it. It's still USA by half a head length. And Aussie are not getting that. <laughs> Lovely to hear the raw report of support for that. But uh, I think uh, USA just held that one. Murray, we're, uh, we're seeing um, the next team come into this starting lineup. Czech Republic and Russia. And they're off. I think um, Czech Republic a little bit slow getting off that one though. And it, it tells that the Russians are about a metre in ahead. Yeah. Now Czech Republic are opening up. Let's see what they can do in the last half of the race of this race. Don't think they're gonna make it. Who knows? Who knows? Oh they're they're really going now. So this is Italy, Hong Kong in race five, uh, sorry, in heat um, five. Uh, Italy acknowledging and Hong Kong. They're still known as Hong Kong China because Hong Kong is a, a special administrative area of China. And they're off. And there they go. Yes, you can see that the Hong Kong guys, they're taking a lead straight away and they're doing the Chinese style stroke. They're doing it very well, already half a length up, halfway down the course. China, Italy. Italy are doing their normal stroke but just a little bit faster. There we go. And there we go for Italy. Here we go. Stand by. Here we go. Well, yeah, yeah Great Britain should, are ahead. Should take this, yes. But they're doing their normal stroke, but just a little faster. They'll get on, come unstuck when they get in the next round. Yep, it's going to be Great Britain on the line. I think Guam are uh, really doing something fantastic. They, they copied the Chinese and the pace that they were doing there then, and... Uh, I think they're going to improve rather faster than people thought when they first saw them yesterday. So that's one more race. Now we're going to have the uh, the hotheads racing. China and the Philippines.